Oh, I did this. Like, no way. This was such a good idea. <laughs> All right, y'all, it is Victoria. I didn't even put y'all on my tripod yet because we're mobile today. But, um, so basically today, from description, y'all already know I'm re-dyeing a wig. So y'all may, well, y'all, if y'all have been here the whole time, I'm a wig intermediate slash beginner, okay? I really only started wearing wigs because I started doing YouTube. Whole story. Anyway, today we have one of my wig fails. <laughs> this is a ombre 613 wig. Um, it just, I did it wrong. I tried to dye it myself, it didn't work. So right now I'm filling up a tea kettle full of hot water so I can remove the hair dye using baking soda and um, what's it called? Soap and shampoo. So yeah, gonna heat this up on the stove and then we'll get into it. I'm gonna show you all the wig though. I'm gonna show you what, what we're working with because I really tried my best. This is the wig. She's lit right now. It don't look that bad on camera, but um, she's been through it. The ombre isn't even. There's just a lot going on. I'm just going, yeah. But once again, I've never used this dye removal method. So if this don't work, I'm gonna be mad. But I also have another 613. Cause I want this to be also marine. I already got the hair dye. I'm watching YouTube tutorials. I feel confident. But I also feel confident in this ombre. So, I don't know, I've combed out the wig. This ombre really could have been so cute. Well, damn. Okay, y'all, the water is boiling. I might have overfilled it a little bit. Sorry, sorry, oh, sorry, please don't burn me. I just got burned by a bunch of uh, boiling water literally yesterday. So, I think I'm okay on that. I'm just gonna put y'all right here. I need to go get my tripod, but I don't know where it's at. But anyway. I'm filling up this, y'all know, I, I guess I'm gonna wash my wigs, but filling it up. It's like a little mop, like dishes thing. I don't even know where I got this, like collapsible. But anyway, I'm filling it up with this boiling hot water. I hope it's enough water. I went to Kroger, not sponsored. No, I'm kidding, wait, I went to Kroger. Got some Ajax, I was gonna use Dawn, but Dawn is expensive, I'm a college student, But yeah, got some Ajax, and they really just poured it in it. So I'm gonna do the exact same thing they did. And they said equal parts. I don't really know what that means. Like in this case, because they just poured it. And I don't really know how much or little I'm gonna need. So I'm literally just gonna do it till it's right. And I'm just gonna kinda. And then they also use shampoo. But I don't know if I should use that too. I don't know. Shampoo. shampoo. So we're gonna hope for the best. Cause it just says shampoo. I'm just gonna put I'm gonna put a little bit more soap. I think I definitely need some more baking soda. This is coming out really slow. I'm gonna put more down. Yeah, you can see better this way. All right, y'all. I've been stirring this for like five minutes, but the up the water is getting really dark. But once again, I probably shouldn't have used the purple shampoo because now I don't know if it's dark because of the purple shampoo or if it's dark because of the dye. But I feel like something is definitely happening. Like, you see, something's definitely happening while I'm mixing this. It's so crazy. I don't know. I, I don't know. Is it getting, is it fading? I, can people even really tell? Keep stirring, I guess. I don't really know what I'm waiting on. I just thought the color was just gonna, you know. I think the color is coming up. Cause it doesn't look as dark, see? <gasps> it is working. Period. Okay, here's my check-in. I don't know if it's really been five minutes, but I'm impatient. I have things to do today. But yeah, the color is still coming out nicely. It just looks very purple right now. I don't know if I need to wash it. Um, Cause I'm not really sure where this purple is coming from. Ah! I'm from besides the uh, the purple shampoo, but I don't see how that's dying my wig or anything. But, hey. I'm dying the wig blue, anywho, so the purple doesn't really matter to me. I just want it light enough. Really, the bottom. I just really need the bottom to keep lightening so I can dye this wig. Just ASMR for you. 
All right, y'all. I don't know how long it's been, but I'm done. I gave up. I was scared. People kept saying this method ruined their hair. So I took it out. So the whole wig is now purple. Well, lavender-ish. I feel like the blue should die fine over this. I'm not really like, concerned about the ends because I think I'm gonna put the ends as navy blue anyway. So it should really be fine. So the dyes I have, I bought three. I have no idea what I'm doing. If y'all don't know that by now, I have no idea what I'm doing. I have three dyes. I'm gonna use these two for the base. Who I'm gonna go back over the ends with the uh, indigo blue after. So I'm gonna try and mix these two in the water like they be doing on YouTube. And we're gonna see what happens. Okay, so I use some kind of warm water. I'm gonna just eyeball it. I don't really know what I'm looking for, but first I'm gonna, oh wait, no. First I'm gonna use Aquamarine. And then I'm gonna go in with the Sky Blue. I'm not gonna use the whole bottle, question mark. I, um, Yeah, I don't really know what I'm doing, but I just know this is the watercolor method. I'm gonna pour it that much at first. I poured like a cup, not half the bottle, but you know. I should've put gloves on. This wasn't a smart color. So this is with just the aquamarine. So I'm gonna test on a napkin like the lady did in the video I watched for reference. But hers is a little too green for me. I'm gonna put a little bit of baby blue in mine because I don't really want it green. I need to give me, I need to do something different. Cause even though I'm looking at this color, like the color that the water is right now, it's a little too green. But now I feel like it's gonna be a little cute blue, but I'm gonna go get a paper, what you call it, and look in a second. Once I mix all the dye, let's see what. That's light. Did I do something? Maybe I need to put more dye. Maybe I should put a little bit of navy blue. You know, this is my video. I'm gonna put a little bit of navy blue in the dye, but this is like purplish. These are all different. I'm scared. I'm gonna put a tag, like a literal drop of navy. Cause now I'm really scared. Cause this looks, it's giving purple. And now I'm afraid, but I feel like this might be giving it a little bit of darkness that it needed though. Cause y'all can't really, it doesn't look that different to y'all. This is the color I want the hair to be, but a little lighter, okay? This is it, but I don't think it's gonna come out that way right now, the way this water looks. Let me try again now that I put a little indigo in there. Ooh, that made a difference. Okay, that made a difference. Cause look, here's without indigo, here's with indigo. <laughs> O-M-G. I'm not even got to being the wig, the, the lace. I'm just gonna prep. Because I saw on TikTok, this girl said we don't have to do that. Oh. Her watercolor method. This is very cute. I'm scared to put the lace in. Oh, oh nothing, oh nothing. Oh, okay. Oh, it's already on. Y'all, this was such a good idea. Whoever told you that black girls can't be scientists? Who said that? Cause they were wrong. This, I don't even need to use the navy like underneath. Like I don't need to go back. I really, Wow, I did this, like no way. This is so cute. Like, oh my goodness. I can, this color is so, y'all gonna see on my Instagram photo. If you're watching this late, look at my Instagram. Like if you're watching this years later, months later, look at my Instagram. If I didn't post a picture in it, then something terrible must have went wrong. Cause this wig is so freaking cute. Like I can't wait for this on. I cannot believe I did this myself. I gotta call my friends. I gotta call my friends, <laughs> but my, oh my glove. I gotta call my friends, so stop the video. Okay, y'all, this wig came out so freaking cute. Like, I can't wait for it to dry. I'm kind of scared it's gonna be a little too light, though. I don't know if I thoroughly got every section. I'm really scared. Like, I'm kind of, I'm done with the wig. I'm really done with the wig. I'm adding a little bit more dye to the water, just in case. But I really think it's done. Um, I'm still gonna go in and kind of add uh, turquoise to the bottom, not turquoise, but navy to the bottom before I finish it, finish it. But yeah, it's really done right now. It has like little blue highlights. Like this is such a cute wig. I'm so happy with this. But yeah, I'm gonna let y'all see it installed or if something happens, I'll put it in this video, but it's really over. 
I'm gonna show you the end result though for sure. But if you're impatient, just check my Instagram and there should be something because I definitely posted this cute wig because this is fire. Okay, y'all, I'm not gonna lie. I've had this hair installed for weeks. <laughs> I just have not felt like finishing that video. But anyway, y'all can't really see the color. Um, I'm gonna take this wig off, but I wanted to make a video uh, showing y'all what it looked like before I um, took it off. So this is the color. Don't look at my background, it might be a little messy, but here's the color. I think it's super cute. I got, I've got. i been getting tons of comments on this. People are surprised that I dyed it myself. But um, yeah, that's really it. Here's the end result. <laughs> I will see y'all later. Like, comment, subscribe.